Congratulations guys, that was always going to be a tough match, they're Olympic champions and you've had a lot of history together. Um, can you talk me through the match? Uh, I, think we, I think we came out, um, we were looking forward to the match but um, got off to a terrible start. I made so many errors to start with, we were in good positions and it just gave them every confidence and obviously we know how good their pair are and if we give them more confidence in making mistakes and it's just it's not good and then obviously we uh, managed to get a little bit more into it midway through the second game but again errors came in and they were just a bit too solid and we just didn't play our best and we're not going to beat a pair like that um, if we don't play our best. And in terms of game plan, did that change at all halfway through? Did you change tactics or anything? Um, I think it wasn't really much about uh, changing tactics. I think that, like Chris said, it was more about focusing on us and trying to get our level higher. Um, like Chris said, we didn't come out with the the highest of our levels, so it was main focus was to try and get that and then we know that we can match them when we are playing our best. Okay, and so obviously taking away some positives from the match, you've got the Swiss Open next week. Um, what are you sort of going to work on and progress to uh, next time in the other tournaments? Um, I think obviously the frustrating thing is it wasn't anything technical or tactical, it was purely just mistakes and obviously that's just something that um, isn't good enough at this level.